Finally, what does it take to become an astronaut? Well, a new BBC programme is finding out. Among 12 contestants being put through their paces are two people from the East Midlands. They've been through a series of gruelling physical, mental and psychological challenges to see who's best suited to the job. Elise Chamberlain reports. Being an astronaut is a childhood dream job for many of us. That's a beautiful thing. Look at that. But these 12 have been given a unique insight into what it takes to become one as part of a new BBC series. Among them, energy consultant James Hedger from Loughborough and University of Leicester scientist Dr Susie Imber. We got to take part in activities that you just can't pay money to do. So some of the things that we did and some of the places that we went to were just incredible. And the facilities there aren't available to the public. So I feel really privileged to have the opportunity to go and do these things. For as long as she can remember, Susie's been fascinated by exploring. She's an associate professor of planetary science and has even worked for NASA for three years. Exploration is what really appeals to me and being an astronaut is much like that. It's like modern day exploration in space, but also um, you get to do science as well. As well as physical fitness, the show, fronted by astronaut Chris Hadfield, puts the group through a series of grueling challenges to find out who's most suited to the job. The university here, you could almost say it's Susie's base camp, but this isn't the first time she's ventured into some rather extreme conditions. In fact, it's like she's been training for a challenge just like this. Susie's an experienced mountaineer. Having written a computer code to identify mountains that have never been climbed before, she's been on expeditions all over the world to tackle them. I've been stuck in a tent for 12 days without being able to leave it in a massive storm. We've had our cars just freeze. We've picked up the antifreeze with our fingers out of the car engine because it's so cold. She's also an elite rower, lacrosse player, rock and ice climber. It seems this is the perfect challenge for her. A combination of the skills that I happen to have picked up along the way, one way or another, you know, so from lacrosse and rowing and, you know, and doing physics and mountaineering. Yeah, it did definitely feel as though, you know, somehow I ended up doing the right thing, so. We'll wait and see. Yeah. <laughs> Do you know, I put Susie in space. She could do Absolutely. everything. Absolutely. My money's on her. Definitely. Yeah, I agree. And you can see the first episode of that series on BBC Two on Sunday evening at nine o'clock.